Once we've received information from the client regarding the requirements for the heat pump, we arrive on site with the appropriate uh, amount of steels for drilling and pipe loops. Initially, we do a service check and we will do a CAT scan of the area to locate any services and on top of that we will dig an inspection pit uh, down to a metre to confirm there are no services. Drilling then proceeds with the casing, which is drilling through the overburden until we encounter rock. That can vary considerably uh, depending on the, the location. With regards to the amount of overburden we encounter, that can be from zero, i.e. straight onto bedrock, or it could be up to over 50 metres of overburden. Overburden consisting of uh, a wide variety of materials, soils, sands, gravels, clay. Um, so what we intend to do is, is drill through the overburden and at least two metres into bedrock. This metal casing, which is driven into the bedrock, is then sealed with a grout. This is to prevent contamination of the groundwater with surface water. Uh, on completion of that, that, we then do open hole drilling through the rock. This is a diameter of 110 millimetres. Uh, the hole is drilled to require depth. Obviously when we're drilling there are drill cuttings coming up from the ground. These are collected in a waste collection system and the containment skip so there is no mess uh, around the drill site or on, the, on site at all for that matter. The drill cuttings are removed from site and the skip and disposed of at an approved landfill site. On completion of the drilling to the required depth, pull back out and then we feed the pipe loop through the pipe loop collector. This is fed down at a steady pace to the required depth. Uh, if there's water in the borehole, we have to counter the buoyancy when installing the pipe loop by filling with water until the pipe loop is fully installed. Uh, on completion of that, the pipe loop will be flow tested and also pressure tested to see that there no damage or obstruction within the pipework. Thereafter, the borehole was capped with a casing cap and left until such time it was to be connected into the, the heat pump within the building.